with another wig video and today's wig is brought to you by hair so fly thank you so much hair so fly for sending me this wig i wish to leave the link below to this wig their direct store and also their wig blog so let's get into this So also huge shout out to Jess the Dragness channel because she reviewed this wig too and she totally slayed. One thing with the wig that she did, um, she straightened it out and it still looks bomb. So let's see how I like it. Who knows, I might end up straightening it out too. I don't know. But the brand of the wig that I have today is Bobby Boss. I have one of their premium synthetic wigs. The style that I have is M701 Kelly in the color TT1B slash BL.ST. It also said that this wig is curling iron safe. It doesn't say the amount of degrees, but I am guessing 400 or less than that. The model looks so pretty. When I actually saw this wig, I did think of Kelly Rowland because she kind of had a style like this kind of way back. Kind of similar so I'm hoping it's giving me some Kelly Rowland vibes you know so this is the wig I got the same color as the model that blue is just calling my name oh my god so it has black roots and then it fades into this midnight blue which is so gorgeous as for the texture the texture is on the silky side you guys um, there's no lace to cut, but at the top you do get like a skin top. So that's really good because it looks like it's coming from the scalp. So on the inside of the wig, you have no combs, but you do get your adjustable straps. As for the shine on the wig, I kind of do feel like the wig is a bit shiny. So I'm just going to take some dry shampoo, spray it, and then pop the wig on my head. So some of you guys are probably thinking like why is the parting over here? I honestly lined up the tabs properly so that's where the parting falls but on the model hers is in the middle so I don't know and it looks like I'm gonna have to cut the bangs. But if you want, this is one way you could wear the wig. I actually think this wig is very pretty and I super, super, super love the color. With this wig on me, I feel so grown, you guys. Like, I feel like I'm at least, I don't know, 26 going to my job or something. But I really, really love it. I'm so glad I didn't get it in black because I feel like the black would have made me feel super old. But it's really pretty. So the bangs do come a little bit longer. So I'm guessing they kind of did that. So if you want, you could cut the bangs yourself. Do I want bangs? Let me see. I kind of like it like this, but something is kind of telling me to cut the bangs at the same time. So I'm gonna cut the bangs, you guys. Let me go get my scissors.
on this wig you guys I honestly love this wig on me it makes me feel grown and just I just love the color I love everything about it I love the flips I love how I cut the bang even if you don't want to cut the bang you just want to swoop it to the side I honestly think this wig is still gorgeous and there is nothing bad to say about the wig I got no shedding I got no tangling as for the cap size the cap size is big head friendly but I had to put the adjustable straps really close together to get it really snug so you gotta remember there's no like combs in there for people that love combs but if you want you can always add combs if you're like such a really comb fan like I really love it I could see myself rocking this wig in the fall and in the winter it is so gorgeous I love this wig you guys Bobby Boss y'all did it again y'all did it again and then look at it this wig is bomb oh lord oh lord oh lord Bobby Boss just keep doing it again wow so I'm not gonna hold up you guys time tell you guys what you think do you like it is it a no-no on me what you gonna tell me I look like Kelly Rowland <laughs> so that's pretty much all I have to say about the wig and as always thank you guys so much for watching and have a great day see you guys in my next video Mwah. <laughs>